Joining us here in the studio are PSL players from Sistema, AJ Pareja and Chris Makasait. Good evening and welcome to the Solar Sports Desk. Man, you guys are tall. Okay. <laughs> but we should be used to this. I, we used I know. To, uh... We're always the smallest people on the set when you have guests. But first of all, okay, now that you guys are teammates in Sistema, before though, um, you guys actually played against each other. Okay, in right. college. Yes. And not only just played yes. against each other, yeah, we like played a against... Pretty big rivalry yeah. there. <laughs> La Salle Ateneo. So uh, <laughs> let, let's talk about, you know, a little bit about that. The, the background first uh, of the two of you before mm -hmm. going to the PSL. Uh, you played for La Salle. Yep. And you played for Ateneo. Yes. And what was that like going up against each other? Mm, it's like a bitter rivalry also. Mm -hmm. Tapos every game. Um, I think our record between the two of us is 1-1 one, one the whole season, UAP. <laughs> so, yeah, basically, rivalry is there and then, yun. Yeah, parang before, uh, in men's volleyball in UAP, the rivalry is really between FEU and UST. Yeah. Those okay. are the two powerhouses yeah. team. But for us, parang when, at the start of the season, sinasabihan na kami, um, matalo na sa lahat, wag na sa lasal. Oh. <laughs> so, of course. It's like that. Yeah. <laughs> parang, it, I guess okay. it happens in every sport though, yeah. with, between the two schools. Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. But here's the thing, okay, um, obviously you guys played against each other mm -hmm. in college, and then this, uh, before the PSL came along, I mean, I've always wondered, what do male volleyball players do after college? Because the, the ladies, they can play for like Shakey's V-League, but the guys, where, where do you go? Um, for us, siguro mga one day league lang, so we don't usually have regular tournaments outside. So yeah. basically, yeah, one day league and then no practice at all. So rusty yeah. talaga. Bahala na. Yeah. <laughs> parang ano lang yan, um, let's make a team, mm -hmm. parang mga ex-players, sige, yeah. let's join forces, then let's play in a one day league. Mga club, okay. club lang, nothing, nothing too serious. Mm, yeah, nothing too serious. So when you guys heard that the PSL was going to have a men's division, what was your first initial reaction? Um, sobrang excited, lalo na nung first game. So parang dream come true. Kasi I, I remember when I was in elementary, so I see na meron na rin commercial league yung men's team, but it didn't succeed. So mm -hmm. now, we can make history on Saturday also. So ayan. So ngayon na teammates na kayo, wala nang rivalry. <laughs> well, <laughs> wala na kayo, wala na. Wala na. Wala na. It's, wala na. <laughs> it's an even ground na for everyone. <laughs> Uh, even from different uh, origins or different schools. Yeah. Here's the thing though. Now um, that there's a men's division in the PSL, mm -hmm. Final Four na kagad eh. yeah. I mean, there are only four teams for the uh, men's uh -huh. division. And um, we had Richard Gomez and one of his teammates also on the show. And mm -hmm. they said na right from the start, as in talagang super grabe yung, uh, grabe na yung level of competition. Yeah. Kasi, <laughs> all, all, the, all, the talent, <laughs> yep, all, all the talent went to four teams. Yep. Mm -hmm. And speaking of Richard Gomez, you, you guys will be battling each other yes. uh, on Saturday in the finals. Mm -hmm. uh, what's your take on this? Because he actually said that you guys are the team to beat in this tournament. Yeah, when the tournament started, we were up against PLDT right away. Mm -hmm. and, they, um, and we didn't uh, win in that game. So this will be our, uh, our retribution. <laughs> finals <laughs> fair. So it's going to be a sweet victory if we can uh, beat them. <laughs> but yeah. okay, I, ha I have to ask. I, mean, he's, he's, I know he's Richard Gomez. I know he, this guy, has a, he was a Philippine athlete and he's very athletic. He's played all yep. sorts of different sports throughout his entire life. But when you guys see him, you're like, you know, he's out of his prime. I, I can take him. <laughs> but that doesn't, don't, doesn't that thought, does that thought process enter your head? Mm -hmm. Or is it like, I see Goma. Medyo, or you know, do you get a little bit intimidated because he's there on the other side? Um, for siguro, ano, um, medyo namamangha ka rin kasi because yeah. he played fencing, he played archery. Mm -hmm. So, medyo talented talaga siya. At, he's very athletic. Pero, syempre, nandun pa rin na Richard Gomez yung kalaban mo. So, you need to prove something out of yourself. Mm -hmm. And, um, si Richard, uh, lately lang siya nag-start really with volleyball. But um, the thing with him is he's very athletic, so he yeah. picks up easily. Yeah. So we can't underestimate him. Because mm. even it shows him in some games. Niya. Yeah. Um, when he approaches, it's awkward because he's mm -hmm. really just starting out with the sport. But when he gets the timing, talaga, he can really smash the ball. Talagang malakas, with power. <laughs> okay, so what do you think will be your biggest problem when you face his team on Saturday? When the things final, where are you going to be in the team? Nala? Because I mean, again, you guys lost to them yeah. in your first mm -hmm. game. So this, you know, yeah, mm -hmm. where, where, where's it going to come in? Is, this is going to be a revenge factor also for you guys? 
I guess with our last game, our main problem was our floor defense and service reception. So, um, yung PLDT kasi they have organized blocking. So, mm -hmm. um, we're we're an offense-oriented team. So they were able to check us out last um, uh, last game. So maybe with more variation with our plays, with our attacks, we can take take them on. You mentioned that it's a defense-oriented team, uh, PLDT, and he mm -hmm. also said that they're a very they're a smaller team compared to mm -hmm. everybody else. He actually said that you guys are the biggest, the most athletic team. Uh, and he actually named you guys also. <laughs> it's like, when they spike the ball, <laughs> medyo takatakot. But, okay, you, you, call, you said that they're a defensive-oriented team. You guys are more offensive-oriented. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we, we, we've heard the term that defense wins championships mm -hmm. in basketball. In volleyball, is that, does that uh, stand true as well? Uh, basically, yeah, pareho rin naman defense. But, uh, yung offense kasi nagda-drive nung, ano, nung game. Pero, syempre, you, you need to have defense. But, we have, uh, siguro, block, in terms of blocking, we're number one team naman. So, our main, ano, kasi, defense is our blocking. With AJ and Rocky. So, we have six, five guys there in front. So, yeah, basically, that's our first line of defense. When it comes to the league, again, um, this is the first time na nag men's division. Mm -hmm. The women's uh, division, now they have imports. For the men's division, do you see yourself, like, has it been discussed na, okay, next season, magkaka-imports na rin tayo? Or maybe expand or, six yeah. teams, Baka dumami naman yung teams. <laughs> <laughs> As of now, parang we're getting rumors na there will be six teams. Mm -hmm. Tapos, um, of course, we would like... Um, to also experience having imports and to know how they play the sport because yeah. this league is the main I think vision of the league is to elevate the game so we yeah. we can only elevate the game if we have outside um, mm -hmm. influences also who are more advanced with regards to the sport to uplift mm -hmm. the yeah. local flavor as well now what is it do you th why do you think that volleyball has kind of skyrocketed in terms of popularity here in the Philippines because you know for the longest time We've had what? We had basketball mm -hmm. and then boxing mm -hmm. and then football. a little bit of you know the football craze happened, mm -hmm. a little bit of the rugby here and there. <laughs> Badminton was even alive for, mm -hmm. for a time. And now volleyball seems to be the sport that's really growing rapidly. Why is it that you think that volleyball has finally uh, grown, especially as, as volleyball players? Mm, siguro ano lang, um, yung passion kasi ng players, you can see it. And then also the rallies, long rallies, especially in the women's side. You can see long rallies and then yung mga parang impossible na na magda-dive pa yung bola. So yun, siguro, that makes us, uh, the fans excited and also, siguro ano, yun nga, yung mga players din kasi, uh, ma talented. I'm glad you mentioned the, the, the rallies with yep. the women's side. Okay, here's the thing. <laughs> What, what is the main difference between how women play volleyball and how men play volleyball? Because I'm just saying, if a guy was spiking a ball in my face, I'd be terrified. <laughs> you know. um, maybe um, with the so women's division, people enjoy yung mga long rallies, yung mga difficult saves, yung mga natataas bigla yung bola. Unlike sa men's, naman, um, it's really fast-paced, um, power-oriented. Yeah. Okay. But one thing um, differing from the, between the men's and women's, yung sa men's, mas may, ano yan, eh, may mga aggression factors yan, yeah. may mga trash talk mm -hmm. involved. So yung mga yabangan sa court, <laughs> people enjoy those ano, mga stuff like yung mga antics. So, so when you say kill in men's volleyball, it's talagang kill. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody yeah. asked me, AJ, what is your vertical leap? I, yeah, have you ever? That. So have you ever? Mm. Did you guys ever me uh, measure measure this before the season started? Because so, somebody asked me, "What's yeah, age?" I, I don't know. I cannot recall, but <laughs> I can say that um, I level ako when I jump. This is that tip of the net, tip of yung net. So <laughs> so the net's like yeah. this, yep. and your <laughs> arm is way above, yeah. and it's like. I can't imagine who's going to be on the other side of your of those smashes. I, na special mention siya eh. Yeah, na special mention. Because of his vertical leap. Yeah. So, okay. Good okay. luck on Saturday. So, <laughs> Saturday, why don't you invite everybody out there to come support Sistema. Yeah, finals. Finals. First, uh, first ever. First ever. Make history. You can make history and, uh, you know, for this this coming Saturday, I mean, perhaps the first champions of the PSL men's division. We invite everybody out there to come uh, watch you guys or watch you guys in, in solar sports. Um, uh, we would like to invite uh, all of the fans of volleyball, men's and women, so support Sistema um, on Saturday and also the women's division. Um, mga taga Batangas dyan, Lipa City. So, yun, manood kayo. Yeah, it's gonna be at 11.30 at uh, Inares Stadium at Pasig. 
Um, I'm calling all my relatives and <laughs> colleagues from Medical City. Hi. <laughs> so he already stayed in Medical City. So he is in med school. He's, that's the thing. He plays volleyball <laughs> and he wants to get into orthopedics. Yeah. And of, so if he get hurt, mm -hmm. yeah, he <laughs> <don't> <laughs> have to do it. <laughs> All right. right. Thank you so much and good luck on Saturday. Good luck on Saturday. Thank hope, you. And hopefully you guys can guest once you're champions. Yes. Oh. Ah. Looking forward to that. Yeah. <laughs> Looking Mama, forward sorry, to that. Yeah. <laughs>